Okay, so our author, Jim Murphy, was trying to make two points in our read aloud today. I'm going to read um, one passage to you that is from a read aloud today, and I want you to decide what was most soldiers' point of view regarding how doctors treated wounds and injuries during the Civil War. Base your decision on this passage I'm about to share with you. Passage one from The Boys' War by Jim Murphy. Most soldiers looked upon the doctor's work as useless mutilation heaped on top of injury, and the fact that large numbers of the injured would linger in agonizing pain for days only to die did not enhance the reputation of the medical profession. One boy, obviously very angry, wrote a blunt condemnation of what he was witnessing. I believe the doctors kills more than they cur cure doctors Hank got half cents. Unless absolutely necessary, most soldiers would stay as far away from doctors as possible and treat themselves as best as they could. Teas made from the bark of slippery elm, willow, and dogwood trees were favored remedies for anything from a cold to infected wounds. Wounds were treated by daily cleaning and the removal of anything foreign. So based on this passage, tell me what you believe most soldiers' point of view regarding how doctors treated wounds and injuries during the Civil War was.